Kirsten, is the, is the entrance you guys are at off of Highway 2, or do you go into the fairgrounds? It's just the beginning. Off of Highway 2, go all the way past the fairgrounds. Of the journey home. Yellow labs, white labs, silver labs, chocolate labs, and black labs. So the full rainbow of labs. Five hours in a van, and these labs have found themselves in Monroe, Washington. 40 dogs in total rescued from a breeder in Ponderé County. The animals are, are actually in, in pretty good shape. So they were being well fed um, and they you know, appear to be in good health. They're all young. Kirsten Gregory is with Posado Safe Haven. We can start unloading and hook these. She says an overwhelmed breeder had reached out for help, but because shelters and rescues are already over capacity, help wasn't available and the problem grew. And this was a breeder that oh. knew that they had pumpkin more than they could handle. The Ponderé Sheriff reached out to Posado Safe Haven. It's one of a few shelters that covers the entire state and can handle a mission of this size. Uh oh, close the doors. Close the doors, Scott. Kirsten called the rescue unique, both because of its size and circumstance. Uh, she popped the window out of the crate and, and managed to escape from her crate sometime during the ride. So she found a nice comfy spot back in the corner and doesn't want to come out. She says the dogs don't show any signs of trauma just stress from a long day. But Owen's a dog whisperer and he's going to get her squared away. These crews, like the breeder, want what's best for these animals. Um, but the rest were probably all under two or three. The next step on their journey, finding a forever home. And then we'll go get the, uh, the other one, Scott. Nice work. Nice work to you. That was a lot of dogs. They're going to be doing some health exams on these dogs, but I'm told within the next two weeks at the different organizations, you'll see them up for adoption. In Monroe, Callie Greenberg, King 5 News.